afternoon. This is Jim Lakey with news and announcements for St. John and Maxfield, Kansas, here in Stafford County, and on Cable Channel 3, and also on Sandy Land Center, our website. Today is Monday, it's the 3rd of April already, 65 here in the square this morning. The afternoon, uh, Monday, we have uh, Sunday, yeah, sunny, and 72 the high for today on Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, both, well, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, all are partly cloudy and windy. But the temperatures are very different. The high temperature on Tuesday, 80. The high temperature on Wednesday, 73. And then 67 on Thursday. Then we have sunny on Friday with 74. And on uh, Saturday, sunny and windy with another high temperature of 80. So we'll have a couple of high temperatures of 80. And... Uh, that's certainly nice weather to have, especially if you are going to have to go out and mow the lawn, because I'm sure it's going to grow if it gets any rain. And of course, rain is something we aren't getting. Anyway, we have some birthdays. There are no birthdays for today, but for Tuesday, happy birthday to Karen Daly, Charlene Maxton, and Helen G. And we hope that you three have a really great birthday. And we remind you again of the basket sale at the uh, uh, Second Chances Thrift Store. And they're trying to reduce their uh, winter things and come out with summer things. And it's a shame when they just have so many things that they have to send good things uh, to have them recycled as rags. So, all the clothes that you can put in a basket are $4. Then, uh, winter coats are $2 on special, and then prom dresses are available as well. Uh, now, for the Recreation Commission, <coughs> on uh, Thursday this week, they're going to Cool Beans and Smith's Market in Hutchinson. And it will include uh, shopping in the market and also uh, lunch. After lunch, uh, then they'll come home after they go to the market uh, and be here by 3.30. And it's a $20 cost for both the transportation and the lunch. Then on uh, Thursday, they're having a shopping trip to Great Bend. And I wonder if that is replacing one of the trips to Great Glen that they're doing uh, to take people who need to go shopping. But anyway, the shopping trip to Great Bend, they leave at 9.30, they get at Great Bend and shop at Walmart, and then they have lunch, a lunch buffet at uh, Pizza Hut. And it's $7 for transportation, but uh, you you have to pay for your own lunch at Pizza Hut, in addition. Then uh, we have our senior menus, and here in uh, St. John, uh, we're having hamburger steak today with mashed potatoes, baked turkey patty and sweet potatoes on Tuesday, pork roast and noodles on Wednesday. <coughs> well, over in uh, Maxville at the VIP Center. They're having sweet and sour chicken and rice today, liver and onions or smothered steak, a choice, and baked potatoes on Tuesday, and boiled pollock on uh, Wednesday. And uh, so our last announcement is about work ahead on the roads. And from uh, the junction of 281 and 50, they'll be working on 50 Highway all the way from there to Maxville. And there are apt to be lanes where there's only one lane that's going with a flag car going back and forth. So if you're going to go to Maxville from uh, here on Route 50, you may run into uh, different kinds of uh, traffic problems. So plan to take uh, extra time. 
because the pilot car will make a delay of 15 minutes if you get there exactly the wrong time. And uh, that's all the news and announcements we have. And the word of the day is a perfectionist. It's someone who takes infinite pains. Unfortunately, they also give them to other people. This is Jim Leahy, hoping you have a really great week.